Jim Hutchinson at the 2022 Atlantic City Boat Show here in New Jersey, and it's great to be back on the show circuit. It's been a long time. Tony Develli's with Contender Boats, and I happen to be a huge center console fan. Uh, 360 degree vision. Uh, you can fight a fish gunnel to gunnel, uh, uh, bow to stern. It's an outstanding fishing machine, and Contender is probably, I know from the Northeast, there's just a lot of them. You guys are just about the top high performance center console for fishing in our, in our market. Sure. That's correct. We pride ourselves in the fishability of these boats. These boats give you a flat flat platform that you can fish all the way around the boat. The combing is consistent no matter where you fish on the boat. Great visibility, like you said. It's 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 the best platform for fishing. What, what kind of sets Contender apart from anybody else in terms of the production um, basis? I think innovation. Innovation. We're always we're we're never satisfied with where we're at. We're always charging ahead. We're always R and D. We're always researching and developing new products on a daily basis. The engineers do a phenomenal job mm -hmm. for us, so you know we're never we're never satisfied. The one thing I notice, and uh, I'm always window shopping, looking at boats. You know, you look in the Fisherman magazine, the classifieds, and all over the place. I don't see a lot of previously owned contenders out there. What is that a basis of the? the the strength, the performance, the construction, what is that? It's a testament to all that. You know, it's it, the durability of these boats is phenomenal. You know, you could keep this boat for, for your lifetime or the lifetime of the vessel. It definitely proves itself to be worthy for the duration of the boat's life. The great thing about center consoles in terms of looking at the contenders, we'll take a look at a couple of these in a moment, but you know, you're looking at two, three outboard capabilities on the on the stern, and that's giving you that ability to get offshore quicker, safer, and having that fishability that you wouldn't have with any other boat. That's correct. You don't have to worry about, you know, sacrificing a whole entire day on the water, you know, cruising out at slower speeds, being cautious in, in, in you know, inclement weather. These boats are going to get you there safely, and they're going to charge through, you know, compromising conditions better than any other vessel. Uh, what is the lineup, size-wise, in the contender line? Okay, so we currently offer our, our fleet ranges from 25 foot up to 44 foot. Uh, 25 is the bay boat, and then the deep V starts at 25. That's our 25T, and that goes all the way up to the 44. Now we do have three or two cabin boats, which would be the Fish Around, which is offered in the 39 Fish Around and the 44 Fish Around, and we just recently introduced uh, the 44 CB, which is a small berth. So when I say center console, you've kind of gotten out of that and. and built from that, the, when you talk about the walk around. Yeah, I mean, it, it seems like that's what people want, you know, yeah. they, they want a little ple little place to get out of the weather, you know, heat up a little hot meal, never never hurt anybody. <laughs> What's new then for 2022 that we're looking at? So what we're, we're, we're going to do a relaunch of the 22 and 24 Sport, two models that did a great job for us, but we're doing a little bit, you know, some subtle changes to those two boats, and uh, I think they're going to work out great. Terrific. And obviously there's new stuff in the pipeline all the time. What's the the line for buying the boat, how long are people looking at it? Absolutely. It, it's very, um, it's model specific as far as wait time goes. So really start looking now. I mean, it's, you know, this is not something you want to sit back and wait, come take a look at Contender, go see your dealer, it's start never, talking about it. It's never a bad time to get your name in the hat. <laughs> <laughs> exactly, right. I think that's what we've come, grown accustomed to in yeah. the last year and a half. So. Yeah. Um, with lead times decreasing, you know, that, that's, a, that's a result of parts coming in, um, motors being available. Uh, we've been, you know, getting product faster than anticipated at this point. Guy looking at a contender, whether it's a 25 on up to 38, uh, is he going to work with his dealer to kind of customize things? Is this, that's, the beauty, that's the beauty of the contender boat is that we listen to the customer. We sit down with the customer. We find out their lifestyle. How are they going to use this boat? Where are they going to use this boat? And we're going to sit there just as you would with a custom home builder and design this boat around them. And we are one of the few boat builders that's going to do that that is semi-custom, semi-production. Um, so that's an advantage that Contender has always had. You know, we're going to do everything we can to get you the boat exactly how you want it and need it. And I know for us in the Fisherman Magazine's region from Delaware up into New England states, great dealer network, great support, everything that goes along with that. You know, we wouldn't be where we are today without the dealers. Those guys really are, you know, the front line for us. They have the first line of communication with the customers. They're the ones that, that, that get the information from the customer and give it to the reps, then in turn give it to production and, and deliver the boat they've always dreamed. You know, a lot of my buddies who are charter captains, they trust their contender. It seems to be that hardcore fishing. You know, what is it about that? Is it, I guess it's something you see throughout the country. 
Yeah, yeah, our customers uh, are loyal to us based on our, our construction processes and the innovations that we've taken over the years. <clears throat> Stepped Hall has basically, basically taken us to the next level. We were early in that game and it's reaped benefits that were unimaginable. So what the Stepped Hall does is there's small vents on either side of the, the boat's hull side that introduce air into the boat's running surface and by doing so it increases your performance, your fuel economy, your top speed, you know, everything. It, it, everything is an improvement at that point. You know, we, we find that that is a necessity for these guys that are running offshore. The, you look at a contender and it's a beautiful machine and obviously it's a hard fishing machine, but what is it the stuff that we don't see, the construction process? Explain that to me. So the 25T up until the 44 is our three-piece boats. So the three-piece construction uh, is your hull, your liner, and your cap. Three, the three-piece construction enables the boat to have that flexural strength that you need for that rough water capability. Um, Two-piece boats we include in our, in our bay boat and our 20, 22 and 24 that we will be releasing. Um, the fish arounds, again, they have the cabin below, they are three-piece boats as well. And that, that provides, again, the strength that is needed for that rough water. Go see your local dealer. You know, that, that's where this starts. You know, they, those guys are going to listen to what you have to say and help you understand how the boat needs to be built for you, and then are going to get in touch with me, the local rep, or your rep some in another location. So Roger. Get out there and get it done. I know the first thing I'm looking forward to is getting out with a couple of friends on their contenders this spring and into the summer. But I think we're going to do some more. We've got some stuff planned. We've got some uh, some events arranged where the, the uh, fisherman crew is going to be out on a 39 ST and a 44 FA. So uh, we're really looking forward to that. To that. And thank you. I told you, 2022 is the best year. We are through it, and it's getting better, baby. <laughs> Tony, thank you so much. Love it. Appreciate it. Thank you.